Hey pharmacist, here's the difference between these three IUDs, Marina, JDES, and the newer Kylina. These three hormonal intrauterine systems, IUS, but commonly known as IUD, consist of a small T-shaped plastic device that's inserted into the uterus and slowly releases the hormone levonorgestrel. So what's the difference? Let's start with number one, strength. Marina contains 52 milligrams of levonorgestrel. Then we get to Kylina, which contains 19.5 milligrams. And then the lowest is JDES, which contains 13.5 milligrams. But hold on, that's not the total amount of drug that's released to the patient on a daily basis. That is, in fact, the total amount of drug contained within that small T-shaped drug reservoir, which gets released slowly over time. So let's look at each one. We'll start with Marina. Marina starts by delivering 20 micrograms per day initially, then 18 micrograms per day after one year, decreasing progressively to about 10 micrograms per day after five years. That's why the box says it delivers up to 20 micrograms per day, although on average what is delivered is about 14 micrograms per day over the five years. Next is Kylina. Kylina is a bit lower. It delivers 17.5 micrograms daily initially, declines to 9.8 micrograms daily after one year, and decreases progressively to about 7.4 micrograms per day after five years, giving an average of nine micrograms per day over five years. Lastly, JDES. JDES delivers 14 micrograms daily, 24 days after insertion, six micrograms daily at one year, and five micrograms daily at three years for an average of six micrograms per day over three years. Remember, there's not a constant level of hormone that's released on a daily basis with these three IUDs. It actually decreases over time over the years, and that's true for all three of them, although the strengths are different and the amount released per day is also different. Number two, indication. All three IUDs are used for contraceptive control, although Marina and Kylina are used up to five years, and JDES is indicated for up to three years. The other major difference is that Marina has an additional indication, and that's what it is. So essentially to help with controlling heavy bleeding. And some women may experience very little to even no bleeding whatsoever when they're on Marina. So that's why it's particularly helpful for this indication. Number three, size. Size is one of the factors that's used to promote JDES and Kylina to patients who haven't had children yet, because technically it's smaller than Marina. Although, if you look at the back of the box, so this is what they look like. These are the actual sizes of the devices. This is Marina and this is Kylina. I would argue that these are very, very similar in size. A few interesting things is that Kylina, being the newer device, actually has blue threads and both Kylina and JDES have a silver ring around the top of the IUD, which helps in identifying it in an ultrasound. Marina doesn't have this. Number four, cost. You would think that because these three IUDs have different strengths, the price would go down gradually. But in fact, Marina and Kylina are very similar in price. And then you have JDES, which, just, which does come out to be a bit lower. But the thing to keep in mind with JDES is that because it's only three years, if you divide the total cost of the IUD by the number of years that it's indicated, JDES could actually end up being the more expensive option. And this is an example of what it looks like to illustrate what I mean. Time for our summary. There are three IUDs that are currently available that contain the hormone levonorgestrel, but at different strengths. Marina has the highest, then Kylina, and lastly, JDES. They're all used for contraceptive control, but Marina does have that extra indication. Kylina and JDES are slightly smaller than Marina, but I stress the word slightly. And all three have different upfront costs, but important to take in consideration the amount of time the patient is using it, as some might be more affordable than others. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to my channel. See you next time. Bye, pharmacist. Instead, that is the actual total amount. Oh my God, there's a to be in here. Okay.